Hey guys, well, this is Duct Tape Girls 25. This is going to be our first video, and we're going to be showing you how to make duct tape bows. Um, the bows look like this, but I'm not going to be showing you how to do the design. I'm just showing you how to make the bow. So let me just get you a more simple one. So here they are. This is what they look like. Um, you're going to need some bobby pins, or just one if you're making one bow. So... Here's your materials. You're going to need duct tape, um, two colors, mainly, as many colors as you want, actually. Um, X-Acto knife, or if you don't have an X-Acto knife, scissors, but if you do use an X-Acto knife, still get scissors. And I just get non-stick scissors and a cutting board if you're using an X-Acto knife. So, um, my plain color is going to be blue. So, first, you're going to take your middle piece, and you're going to just do this. And you're going to cut like a fourth of an inch off, as big as you want. Because I like tiny centers, if you saw my bows. And did I say my center was going to be purple? Well, if it, I change my mind, it's going to be blue now. Okay, so I make them um, two and one fourth. So you can make them a little bigger, but um, I'm going to make it two and one fourth. So you're going to make two pieces of two and one fourth. So I just cut those. And you can do different colors, so they're like different sides, but it, once you put on your bobby pin, you can't really see the other side. Because it's not like a reverse ball or anything. So, now that you have your two and one fourth inch pieces, you're going to flip one of them over. So it's sticky side up. Oh, I hate when they curl up. That bugs me. And then, take your other one, and just set it down right on top of there. So now you should have like a duct tape, no stickies. Now here's where your scissors come in handy. You guys are, see how you have like little white stuff? I'm still not perfect. So you're gonna cut the edges off. So now you have little, so now your edges are perfect. Now here's the hard part. So you're gonna fold it accordion style. So you're gonna fold it over like a fourth on both of the sides. So, see, you have these two folds. And then you're going to flip it over and you like leave this down so it's like that and then fold it over where that fold is now. So now you have like an accordion. See? Now it's like an accordion. So fold like that. I'm sorry, it's hard to kind of explain that. So that was confusing. <laughs> So now you should have two accordion little fold thingies. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're going to take those flaps and pull them back like that. Hold on. <laughs> My bow let them fold it. Okay, so now you're going to take those two flaps and pull them back. And then you're going to like push the center forward so it will like... So push it with like your thumb or something or another finger on the back and then just smush it down the middle so it has a bow. And then it should be able to do this perfectly. If it does that, then it's a good bow. So now you're going to take your center and you're going to just wrap in your center piece and you're just going to wrap it around bow. Now, you're probably wondering, what about the bobby pin? Well, here's where the bobby pin comes in. So the front of the bow is the one with like the flaps going back. If they're coming forward at you, then it's the back of the bow. So here's where it comes in. I like to do this second. I, mean, I like to do two of them. This makes it better. So you're going to cut another fourth inch piece. And you're going to take your bobby pin. Make sure I feel like I did. And you want to like spread it in half like that. Because it just like, so you can slide this on. So now you're going to hold your tape like this. I'm sorry, this is hard to make my fingers work. And then you're just going to slide this right on top of there. So you should have this. So now you're going to go to the back of the bow. 
and you're gonna set your bobby pin right there. And then you're just gonna wrap it around. So now you have a bobby pin in the back. So, and then just like, oops. Oh, sorry, I didn't want to show my face. So, it just see you clips <laughs> So it's really cute, and if you made it right, it should do this, and it should have like three folds in it, and it should be really cute. Like that. So thanks for watching. Bye.